Today, we are commemorating one of the most horrific events in the history of the city of Chisinau. We're standing in the Chekhov Theater, site of the former Coral Synagogue. The wall behind us is part of that synagogue. This was a vital center of community and religious life at the beginning of the 20th century, when Chisinau was nearly half Jewish. 120 years ago, on 19th to 21st of April 1903, an anti-Jewish pogrom took place at a time when there were large-scale pogroms throughout the Russian Empire. False news distributed by the local press claimed that two children had been murdered by the Jewish community. Instigated by these lies and an environment of anti-Semitism, ordinary people became murderers. Mobs rampaged through Jewish neighborhoods for two days, burning, looting, raping and killing. In the end, 49 Jews were dead and 500 wounded. Homes and livelihoods were destroyed. The local police turned a blind eye and did not interfere. This violence sent an unmistakable message that Chisinau was not a safe place for Jews. We have a moral responsibility to commemorate this horrific past, holding the victims of the pogrom in our memories. We also have to be clear that never again really means never again. In keeping with modern Moldova's spirit of tolerance, it is vital that there is public recognition of what unfolded on those dark days in April more than a century ago in plain sight. Today we reaffirm our commitment and resolution to fight against anti-Semitism and to stand up to those who spread falsehood, hatred and lies. We're honored to join the members of the Jewish community here in Moldova as well as the citizens of Moldova in commemorating this horrific event of 120 years ago today.